Good morning, guys. GM and FD, yeah. GM and FD, everyone. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> there are some things setting up like W and Carvana and maybe Tesla. But I would prefer everything to go sideways for another week or two. Bitcoin is shaping up. It's back to the 58,000 area. Or sorry, no, almost 59.
this AFMD's potential episodic pivot, they had really, really good phase one data apparently. Yeah, that's what I just said. Pen. I'm gonna chill out. I, I've I've done three trades this week. I, I think I made like three trades this week or four. I've never been this inactive in my trading career. Earnings doesn't matter on AFMD. It's a phase one biotech. Doesn't have any earnings. Earnings on early stage biotechs are irrelevant since they don't have any. <clears throat> yeah, before you know it, I'm gonna sit in these uh, dividend stocks. Yeah, I had to, guys. What the fuck is this? I had to go to the store and buy Noco. Why do you guys hate me so much? <laughs> oh, they only had data on four patients? Interesting. Well, that's really not great. Yeah, four patients is... You know, it could uh, as well be just random. I, I just saw some smart people on Twitter tweet positively about it, but I don't know. Good luck, everyone. Yeah, Etsy had an okay kind of a setup yesterday. I passed on it. Instead, I did Shopify. When you took out the highs of the day, mid, late day, midday. It looks like it may <laughs> make may fail here at the 50 day. We'll see. I guess I should have done Etsy.
Damn, there's a storm outside. Yeah, AFMD already traded more than average volume. I'm gonna pass on it. It's way too thin for me. It's just a, it's a micro cap. So who, um, what's the news on it? No, it's, uh, their subsidiary enters merger agreement with Tencent or finalizes merger agreement. That's why it's up. I don't think it's uh, EP. GoPro, I don't think it's a great setup. Uh, I mean, maybe. Not sure. Oh, come on, Shopify. Let's go to the daily view. So much better. Less noise. Yeah, SPLK looks like a decent setup. What are other shipping names? Uh, GSX? No, not GSX. Uh, DSX? Uh, there's a few more. <coughs> NVAX? Um, it's kind of surfing the 100 day, but I'm not sure it's a great setup. I don't know. Nah, I, I don't know. I don't see it. CMRE, I don't necessarily, I don't think it's a trading stock, it's too slow and too choppy.
It, there's gonna be a shop fest until we start seeing a lot of you know good looking bases. There are some bases forming, but I, I think like something like Arc, I think it's a good um, like a thermometer for the type of stocks I like to trade. Um, and right now it's just in the middle of nowhere. Like it could go either way. I, I don't see an edge here yet. But maybe in a few weeks, if we you know maybe build some higher lows and. You know, could be nice, but the 50 day needs to come down. So until then, it's it's a really lot of patience needed. I'm already having a record week. I, I don't think I've ever in my trading career traded this little. I've had day. I usually have a few days per year where I don't trade at all, or only make one or two trades. But this year I had this this year this month this this week I had two or three days where I only traded one thing. I had one entry and one day I didn't trade anything. That tells you a lot about what I think about the market right now. Um, AFMD good volume so far. Again I'm gonna pass on it, but. JPM, good setup, but extremely slow stock. Good setup, but very, very, very slow stock. Like, really slow. 1.9 ADR. Hey, guys, do you know what bank doesn't have a good setup? <laughs> Credit shit. Because they lost a ton of money on their Wang blow up. <laughs> oh, fucking losers. Nomura also. Apparently, Credit Suisse uh, fired their head of uh, head of risk. <laughs> oh. Imagine being head of risk management, and, and you take part in the one of the biggest blow-ups of all time. That's a nice thing to have on your CV. That's what happens when you, you know, get greedy as fuck and use too much leverage, or in this case you give too much leverage. Leverage kills, it really does. You can have stellar returns for a long time and then everything goes to shit.
Riot Volatile Intraday. I can barely see the daily candle. Today's candle. It's so tiny. I don't know what you're talking about, honestly. <sighs> it's like super tight. <clears throat> V Y G. You know what? I, I wish I had bought the float uh, in the in the mid low double uh, sorry single digits when I when I found the thesis uh, and I didn't. That's all I have to say. I don't see a setup here now. Roblox is annoying. Stopped me out the other day. Actually, it didn't. I just sold it anyways because it closed kind of weak. Ugh. Well, well. I kind of shook myself out. I guess. I'm gonna use a white stop on it. I'm gonna trail it with a 10 day. Square, don't tell me it's going straight up. Yes, it is. Oh. Holy shit. The storm is ripping my house apart. Be right back. <clears throat> no, it's uh, it's not bad weather. It's really nice weather. It's sunny outside, but it's just blow. You know, really windy. What made you decide to buy SQ? Uh, I didn't know I bought SQ. Holy shit, man. Look at this LR LRCX. Look at how it's building higher lows. Incredibly tight. Next move is gonna be, I don't know, hopefully 750. Mogo. Yeah. Yeah, Baidu. Yeah, tight range. Not really sure what it wants to do though. Yeah, account is tight, yep. NVST, it's not a trading stock. Forget about this thing.
you can just clearly see it's not a trading stock. It just pulls meanerverts all the time. This thing has no breakouts. Thing, it just pops a bit, goes back. Pops a bit, goes back. Ignore this thing. ADR3. Forget about it. Hundred and fifty kilometer per hour is how uh, many meters per hour is that or meters per second? Forty two meters per second. Uh good luck. Hope you survive. Well, SI, it had a tight range here last week. But yeah, now it needs to probably another three, four days at least before it sets up. Look at how tight MU is. This thing, and it's also building higher lows since the earnings day. Incredibly tight. I think it's going to make a big move once it gets going. <clears throat> load wasn't this a oh battery recycler uh, this has been pumped as a gold stock I here in tc2000 it's under real estate services nice uh, I don't know. I, I don't like it. It's just a random pump stock. There's no institutional support in it. Dude, it doesn't matter when a breakout happens. Why do people think it 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 matters when the when a stock breaks out it doesn't matter when it breaks it breaks it's totally irrelevant most breakouts happen early in the day because that's just how the markets work most action is in the first couple of hours but it doesn't matter it's irrelevant trust me if you if you go to the store you try to be you know you, you and uh, you you're going to pay they're not going to ask you how you made the money. They're like, hey, we don't accept money from late day breakouts. It's never going to happen. If it's a good setup, you buy it when it breaks out. Don't make things harder than they are. I keep getting the question. It's like, I don't know where people get it from. Like, I never even thought about it. But I guess, you know, it's the same questions. And, and there's only one remedy for these types of questions. People haven't done the research. If you study thousands of breakouts on leading stocks going back decades, You'll see they can break out at any type of any time of the day. There is only one remedy for ignorance, and that is education. Yeah, that's going to be Danny's quote of the day. Am I short anything? No, not right now. Yeah, man, Bitcoin. I'm going to go full retard once these things start breaking out. 
GPTC, um, what's the other, this CAM, uh, it's not a great setup, but Riot, especially if these things can go sideways a little bit more. You studied tens of breakouts going back several days and you can concur. <laughs> oh, that was funny. Yeah, the cruise lines are kind of... This thing is actually pretty tight. Uh, where did I add it? Uh, here, okay. So these airlines, they had the shakeouts yesterday and they kind of, you know, holding pretty well. Some of them are really tight, so. Article about different Bitcoin miners. Uh, yeah, GPT isn't a Bitcoin miner. That's why it wasn't mentioned. That's the simple reason why it wasn't mentioned. Man, there's a big move brewing here in the cryptons. There's gotta be something crazy in these things. ETCG, yeah, I know this one. It's 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 incredibly liquid. I mean, this ETHG, it's another, it's an Ethereum trust. I don't know what the difference between ETCG and ETHG is, other than that ETHG is more liquid. Guys, come on, English in chat. OVV, yeah, it looks good. Oh, it's Ethereum Classic, it's another coin. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Yeah, this gaming stocks, SLG, G, GMBL, they're setting up nicely, but they, oh man, they're liquid. Or at least GMBL is setting up nicely.
Yeah, well, I, I, I see what you mean by Rob. It's not like a super clean setup. It's a recent IPO. It's been building higher lows and... Um, and I think it's a very intriguing company. I think these, you know, these types of platform companies can be really, really intriguing. A lot of potential with these types of companies. That's why I like it. Uh, why am I short Twitter? Okay. I didn't know I was short Twitter. I thought I was long. Someone else thought I was long. It's square. It's 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 like, it's like it's not even in my positions list, but yet I was still along it apparently. I don't know where you get guys get these things from. Why am I still holding GME? That's a good question. <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah, sometimes I forgot to add positions here. That's true. Or remove positions. Happens very, uh, very seldom. Though. That is true. Yeti. Oh, I don't see anything here. It's all over the place. I think this is stock. This stock is better traded off the weekly.
I'm gonna just uh, short one bar at a time using that and that button. Yeah, uh, the only problem is I don't have those buttons on my Nordic keyboard. But there are other ways you can adjust. I'm gonna build my own keyboard. No thanks. I'm happy with my keyboard, except I'm uh, missing the page up button. I, I accidentally vacuum cleaned it. Zing. Um, uh, yeah, yeah, I don't know. I guess it was a setup here potentially, and maybe yesterday too. Yes, W, we already been over it yesterday and today. It, it, it's a great setup, it just needs to break out. Carvana too. They pretty much look the same. Carvana, W, very similar. Just needs to break out. <sighs> Thank you, Thank you, Doc. Thank you, Sci-Fi. Yeah, maybe. What's this Rediff doing? Is it still listed? Oh, pink sheets, okay. Yeah, I did my taxes myself in the beginning. Yes, I already have a mechanical keyboard. There's some pretty cool ones, but I'm happy with my one. There's a bunch of old food between the keys, a lot of dust. I love it. I'm gonna watch some YouTube. Did I buy Tiger yesterday? No, I bought it like last week.
Yeah, there's someone keeping track of my positions. I don't exactly know how to figure out where my entry price is and my exits, exit price. I, I guess they kind of guesstimate it, but uh, pretty good effort. This, this stock right here. This is pretty ambitious. Holy fuck. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, yeah, here it is. I did my best to approximate entry exit positions with the information available based on K's live stream, what it tells us, and what we know about this strategy. The, the numbers aren't going to be perfect, but it's a decent enough estimate to learn from. Hmm. Yeah, okay, yeah. Pretty cool. This is a lot of effort. Soxel also, it's a semi name. The same reason why I'm holding uh, AMAT and LRCX. Uh, uh, let's see. TSM2 semi name. Yeah, exactly. Here it is. Cool. Pretty cool. Man, there's so many dedicated people. I love it. I love it. I love dedicated people. Soon you feel like a god? I already do. Hey. I am a god. Yeah. My cult is growing every day. <laughs> what? Wait, 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 what? <laughs> I love this. Cool. Article rating, I'm gonna rate it a five. Why can't I rate it? Oh, I have to uh, subscribe. Uh, T-Cat as a high tide flag, uh, yeah, maybe, M maybe. It is still an intact setup, but a lot of the others, a lot of these um, NFT names have kind of broken down completely. Like this HOFV I'm holding right now, I'm probably going to get stopped out of it today. 
Oh man, I should have done Etsy instead of Shopify. David is here to just keep me company. Thanks, David. That's what a f uh, true friend does. You're so dedicated in camping alone in Oslo, Switzerland. Yeah, you, you, you're, uh, you're welcome here. What's Roblox doing? Is it going higher? Yeah, it is. Damn it. And I have less size than I had last week. Last week, or earlier this week, when I bought it on this day here, I had like 70 or 80,000 shares. Now I only have 50. Damn it. Well... At least I have some, I guess. I wish it was more liquid. If it, if it was more liquid, I would have easily done much more size. These types of like hot IP, recent IPOs, you know, this can make big, this can really make big moves sometimes.
What's this LDI everyone is talking about? Um, a recent IP. Yeah, it's it's a decent looking one. So like an IPO base, really explosive earnings. Yeah, it could work. It's a pretty it's a pretty good one. Pretty good setup. I'm front running it. No, I'm not. Well, most things are acting really nicely. Just all a waiting game. First, you have to be really patient. Wait for those good opportunities in a good market. And then, you have to be really patient and uh, wait for those stocks to play, play out. Inactivity is the key. Airbnb, uh, uh, yeah, it needs more time.
do I apply, uh, buy EMA bounces? Do I use EMAs? Uh, if I add positions when they bounce off moving averages? Nah, not really. No. no. Yeah, very rarely, very rarely. Do you trade stocks and bonds? Yes. I haven't read the fi uh, fi uh, fundamentals, the testimonials yet. I I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it soon. I'm gonna actually. I'm gonna write, start writing that blog post. Yes, I'm a bond pro. I'm an options pro and a bond pro too. Actually, I'm a pro at everything. Thanks for asking. Should I do the testimonials as a page or a post? I don't understand what the difference is in WordPress. Should I do it as a page? Or a post? Page, post, testimonials, page. Okay, okay, so that's the difference. If you want to like edit it in, uh, you know, now and then, it should be a page. Okay, yeah, I'll do a page. Post, post. Oh, for fuck's sake, guys. <laughs> Why do I need testimonials? I don't know. Why do I need a blog? Why do I need to stream? Why do I need to get up in the morning? Yeah, I get it up in the morning so I can drink Noko. That's true. Or maybe I'm doing a testimonials page just to trigger people who don't understand why you, why, you, why you can have testimonials and not selling anything. Just to see their brain cells fry. Maybe that's the reason.
Any news on Sohu? Yes. Do you, uh, do you mean I should cut my losses on David? I should.
Hey, tacked uh, one Calmon. Can I use that in my testimonials page? Yeah, if I if I cut David, it would be the biggest wick I've ever made. R N G U. Mm, yeah. David, is there such a ticker? No. This David's T. For some reason, I, I I don't think David is a T guy. Okay, I added some testimonials and testimonials. I'll add more later. There were there I I got a bunch of testimonials so. Oh wait, what did I do now? Oh.
<laughs> yeah. W winning in, in the game of trading is all about being the best loser you can be. If you if you're gonna if you if you're if you're the better loser than the next guy, you're gonna win. Yeah, I hit some resistance. I haven't posted PNLs on Twitter in a while, that's why. Uh, by the way, guys, this is the stage of the trading day I'm in right now. Be right back, I gotta check this video.
<sighs> Looks like the semi-RNA is pretty strong. I kind of like it. it's been building higher lows. W is getting so tight. Wow. What's Carvana doing? Yeah, Carvana is pretty decent looking too. What's Tesla doing? I'll put it back in my watch list. Uh, Tesla doesn't look as good. <clears throat> Grow, yeah, grow is growing. Oh, is there anything moving? I like how this UPSD is bouncing off the 20 day. Really good price action. Most things in my portfolio look, look very, very good. Can't complain.
Yeah, that's true. I get rid of the ones that don't look good. Yeah, 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 I'm seeing the Fubo comments. I'm ignore it because I don't I don't see a setup here. It, it's just a beaten down stock. It looks too random to me. Not my type of setup. It's kind of bouncing of the rising 200 day, but there's it's just uh, it's not a clean setup, not what I look for. Excel, well, Excel looked uh, even more horrible. At least Fubo is still in some kind of an uptrend. Uh, like this thing lost all of its uptrend, it's hitting like new lows. Fubo is at least holding the 200 day, but you know, I don't know. Not the type of setup that usually makes big moves. Yes, I have looked at Cotton Daily. I've been looking at Coppen daily every day this week since you keep <laughs> you guys keep talking about it. Every day the answer is the same. I just don't see a setup here yet. It needs to tighten up. But maybe next week. Okay, now we've had today's daily daily Coppen uh, walkthrough. Kirk uh, it's too choppy. I, I don't see anything here. 
it looks too random. I would prefer more tightness. <sighs> see, see, yeah, it looks pretty decent. CRTO, uh, I don't see anything here. Yeah, you're already excited, yeah. I'm also so excited about the Fubo and the Cotton discussion on Monday. <laughs> I'm already excited about it. Uber, is it worth keeping on watch? Yeah, it does look bad. It had a great end, uh, setup like last week, but it, it looks... Um, yeah, it's still building this big flag it's been in. What, what's Lyft looking like? Uh, Lyft is not looking good. <sighs> Tightness is rightness, yeah. Any plans for the weekend? Yes, I'm gonna do some stuff with one of my companies and I'll probably, maybe I'll try to do a blog post on my blog. We'll see. I have some administrative stuff to do. Build the keyboard. Chewy. Uh, mm, yeah, it's kind of surfing the rising 150 day. It's, it's really tight here. It's not bad, actually. It's not bad. Not bad. Um, and it's building higher. Yeah, it's actually pretty good. Not, not bad at all. But I would prefer uh, Carvana and W because there's, you know, they're kind of hitting new. Sky is the limit. This uh, Chewy has, you know, it's below the 50 day, below the 100 day. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I, I, my focus is going to be on W and Ch uh, Carvana probably.
PLTR setting up soon. Uh, I think soon is a stretch to be honest. It needs a lot of work. Lemonade. Um, no, I don't know. It's too broken. St stick to the ones that are like holding up. These things are so random. I don't know. Uh, are you serious about SPWH? It's a, it's an obvious buyout. I don't even have to check the news that to see it's a buyout. Ignore this one. It's not a setup. It's a buyout. Pack B uh, needs more work. Love, love sack sounds dirty. Uh, yeah, maybe. INMN, what? IMNM, I don't, IMNM. Um, nah, I don't know. Oh boy, what's my stop on Shopify? Here we go again. If you followed the instructions on the screen, you would know where my stop is. DVAX, uh, yeah, it looks pretty decent. Surfing the 50, building higher lows, getting tighter, yeah. And it's a um, vaccine play, so it's, it's kind of a hot sector-ish. Yeah, GMBL, if it starts breaking up on, on volume, it could be good. VXX, not until the market starts kind of tanking. I, I don't see anything here right now. The market needs to start showing weakness first. The bingo days are over. Yeah. Mm, yeah, it's a semi-stock, but it's not really... Uh, I don't think it's a good setup. My favorite trading stock of 2020? Uh, Tesla. But it's not even close. NIO, I... Uh, yeah, that was a good too, but I kind of missed a lot of this. Um, unfortunately. I kind of screwed it up. Uh, but yeah, it, it's Tesla. It's, it's not even close. My favorite trading stock this year, it's GME and it's not even close. Literally easily a third of my profits this year are from GME, maybe even half. MXIM, uh, no, they, they were shatter, but they're still trading. Oh yeah, I should probably do a blog post about it. I get that question a lot. Like, how did I get to my first million day trading? I should, I, I don't even remember the exact strategies. Like I did a lot of random stuff, but yeah, I should probably do a blog post. <sighs> but you do get a hint. Like if you follow the instructions on the screen, Let's see, let's see if it's there. 
oh look at this the most profitable day trading setup look at this How many alerts do I have at any one time? Hundreds, probably. Mm. Where's the alert tool? Uh, here. Uh, right now I have 205 active alerts. How can I trust Chris is profitable? He's in selling a $5,000 trading course. <laughs> that's a good one. <laughs> oh, that's genius. Uh, hey, can I tweet, uh, quote you on uh, Twitter, Refinery? That's, that's genius. Oh yeah, he's in slow mode. Hey, look, I'll tweet it and if it doesn't approve, I'll delete it. I don't have a lot of trolls. There's a lot of people who ask, you know, stuff they shouldn't because they uh, they don't they haven't followed the instructions on the screen. But but it's not trolling, it's just laziness. Yeah, I know. My my moderators are sacrificing themselves for me. They're in the ditches in the front the front lines and I'm sitting, I'm like a general sitting on the hill far away and I'm like, "Huh. Looks pretty co looks pretty calm out there." While my moderators are in, uh, bloody on the front lines. <laughs> You're not lazy, just dumb. No, I know most people are serious learners, but it's amazing how many questions get answered if you just follow the structures on the screen. Like, I should probably add that you should probably, you know, it probably it, it probably takes like five ten hours to absorb everything in the, on this on the instructions that I have on the screen. You know, that's the amount of you know that people should put in before they even you know ask questions or comment anything. I should probably add that line. Like, I, I want a lot of uh, upfront investment from my followers, from my community. Why can't you go back to the start page on the blog once you climb? Uh, I, I don't know what it means, but you can just click. I mean, you know, the link is you can just follow the link in the bio. 
We can just follow the instructions on the screen one more time to get the link. Did you produce John Wick? Uh, UNFI flag, uh, I don't, I think it needs time. 
it's not really tight. No, I don't like PLTR. It, it, it's just uh, it lost all of its momentum, and it's just you know it's it's nowhere. It, there's nothing here. Needs a uh, it, it needs a lot of work. You have 888 hours left in sharding and studying. Well, at least it's 112 hours less than you had before. <laughs> I'm a philanthropist. I kind of like that. Yeah, I like the sound of that. Philanthropist. Yeah. Hey. That's that's what uh, bored rich people end up like. Philanthropists. I kind of like it.
Oh, is there anything moving? Mm -hmm. SPG. Alright, so this Roblox looks great. Hopefully can have, have followed through to a hundred bucks or plus or something. That would be nice. GBTC. I have like a third size on it. Kind of fading now, but... We'll see. If it closes this week, I'll, I'll probably get out of it. And if it takes out the highs of the day, I'll add to it. What's Bitcoin doing? Bitcoin is, yeah, it's flagging really nicely. It's such a beautiful flag. I, I still, you know, it breaks out over the 60,000 area. It's going to go to 80, 90, 100,000. I think it's going to, yeah, it's a very powerful flag. I mean, think about it. This thing is up. I mean, it... it from like 4,000 from March last year to like 60,000 now. And just in the past like five, six months, it's like a five bagger or something. And it's holding up this nice. Look at how nicely it's building higher lows, how tight it's getting. Like this thing is, it's just so strong. It reminds me about the strength uh, back like uh, late 2017 was similar, you know, it was just had a big percentage move and every time it just held up really well. And then it went in a parabolic mode. Hopefully it goes into parabolic mode this time also, that would be nice. I mean the pyramid steps three to five, Maslow's hierarchy of needs. Wait, where is, uh, let's see, three to five, eight stage model hierarchy, self-actual educational applications, critical, dude, this is rocket science. I actually studied this stuff. Uh, on which of these? Three to five, love and belong, wait, I mean stage what? Three to five? Wait. Where is that message? Uh, three to five esteem needs, which uh, esteem for oneself, dignity, uh, blah blah blah, self actualization needs, yeah, something like that. Oh man, there's too much text here. What was the other link? Uh, the next revolution. What's this? The fuck is this music? Uh, Uh, okay, there's too much text. Yeah, sounds good. I'm somewhere there. What are the rules for the chat? Please follow the instructions on the screen. Like it's literally right there. Type, start or check link in bio if you have questions. Anytime you're about to post a question in the chat, please consider the instructions on the screen. Where do we type start? in the chat or just follow the link in the bio it's not rocket science guys come on
Uh, the hell is this? Thank you, CMAX2608. Yeah, like apps, it's, it's, it's just... 
it needs to tighten up a little bit more. Like, it, it's all over the place. L like, uh, compare apps right now versus, like, down here. Look how tight it was, right? Look at how tight and clean it was. And even here, when it broke out here, look at how tight and clean it was, right? And now, look at th That's the kind of setups you want to see. This is just all over the place. The same thing with KOPN. It's, it's just all over the place. I, d I just don't see... Like, I, I just don't see it. It's, it's not really my type. If we can tighten up a bit more, yeah, it's going to be a five-star setup. Too thin for me. I'm not even going to set an alert on it. Ah, maybe I will. Someone hacked David. Have a nice weekend. Hey, you too, David. Nah, it's not Jim Shanos who has 27 million left. He was another, um, another fund manager. Shanos is down to like 400 million on his short only fund. But he has other funds too, so... But that's assets under management. The article didn't say anything about their returns. Only about us assets under management. Do you ever run a script to scan for volume dry up and pocket? No. I use my eyes. Why don't you apply your techniques on build Bitcoin? Uh, that's literally what I do. Chris, do you have any Lambos? No. Plug any stock can have a setup, but right now there's nothing there. It's just any time it tries to rally, it gets slammed down. Look at this, Colson selling. Why do you have a watch list if you have 200 plus alerts? To be ready for the best ones. Hey, I'm gonna do a poll. Uh, uh, on the average age of you guys.
All right, guys. I'm gonna post a poll. I just posted a poll. <laughs> Almost a boomer. <laughs> I'm gonna click results. Holy shit! That many boomers? Wow! I guess I should have done one category, another category, like 41 to 50, and then done a boomer. <laughs> is 41 a boomer? Uh, in my poll it is. <laughs> I resent the fact you made the boomer cut the 40. I'm sorry guys, I couldn't resist. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, okay. <laughs> yeah, I made yeah two mistakes. Also, if you're if you're twenty, there is no uh, yeah there is no alternative for you. Damn. Too late for poll? No. I'll, I'll post the link again. So it's, it's kind of even. About the third are 31 to 40, about the third are uh, 40 plus, and about the third are th uh, sub 30. Okay. And only 2% are under 20. Okay. Yeah, it's true. Swing trading crowd is not the same as day trading. Yeah, I, I guess if I was a day trader, the numbers would look widely different. I, I guess like a third would be uh, under 20 and another and pretty much everyone would be under 30, I guess. I love you too, guys. Yeah, I was lucky. I'm so lucky I found trading early. I was like 21 when I started trading. I'm super lucky. It's so much easier when you're young and don't have... Uh, <laughs>
30? No, 30 is young. You're in the cusp of pre-boomer. Do you ever feel unful unfulfilled by trading? Yeah, I mean, look, it's... You're not really doing much, you know. You're just looking at a bunch of charts and clicking buttons. It's not a satisfying job in that context. Why do you think I started streaming and sharing all the, context, uh, all the content? That's why I started doing it. But it's not about trading per se, it's what about it's what what you do with the money, I guess. And yes, the government is very happy um, over the tax money. Hey, do you know what the best part is about me putting Boomer at 41 plus? People over 41 plus, they don't get offended as easily. Uh, where can you fill out the poll? I'll post the link. You're offended by you saying my age group gets offended? Do a country poll? Yeah, I'll do a country poll uh, one day. Don't want to do everything at the same time.
asking for a friend how you will trade if you're 50k down from day trading in a year but you still have 30k left for swing trades so you have you have 30k you can very easily trade uh, you know swing trade with 30k that's no problem 30k is actually pretty decent it would be worse if it was like 3k yeah uh you can learn uh, yeah if you want to learn spanish you should go to oslo switzerland Oh man, I didn't realize I had been streaming this long. No wonder my butt hurts. I, I kind of lost track of, uh, of time. Um, let's see, I'm go, gonna go, go through my positions one more time. I'm probably gonna get stopped out of this HOFV. All these NFTs kind of are fading and they, they kind of lost the Momo. Uh, Shopify. Yeah. The semis are super strong. They're all so strong. Twitter is strong. Qs are strong. And TLA is kind of weak. If it, yeah, it should hold this 20 day. If it falls back below the 70 iron, I'm probably gonna sell it. it sh you know, base breakout like this, it shouldn't kind of fall back that far. Uh, we'll see. LRCX looks, I, I, I really think next, next leg like higher it goes to 750. This one, I'm gonna raise my stop a little bit. I'm trailing it with the 20 day. A map two, I'm trailing with the 20. SI looks great, I'm gonna raise my stop. Tiger is strong from the 
uh, rising 100 day bounce ETH yeah uh, I, I'm uh, let's see what does ETH look like ETH USD I'm a bit worried if the or not worried I'm not worried but it would suck if Bitcoin broke out uh, if Bitcoin breaks out during the weekend and all of these uh, uh, crypto names gap up a lot but also you know it could also gap down like you know tank during the weekend so yeah yeah I, I, I'll keep my third position it's GBTC if it closes really weak I'll get rid of it and we'll see um, but I do think if Bitcoin breaks over that 60 it's, it's gonna make a big move maybe it, you know start speeding up even <clears throat> And Roblox today's entry, pretty, yeah, it's strong. I really like the company. Or, or their, you know, business model. Uh, and I'm sh I'm a bit excited about some stocks. This W looks great. It, it made an enormous move last year. And now it's been digesting, been building higher lows and higher lows and getting really tight. Um, this Carvana... Kind of similar, it's made a big move, now we've been digesting this move. Mm, the airlines don't look as good anymore. This Fiverr looks interesting. Also really like the company and the stock. And uh, I think it, the setup is so-so, but uh, yeah, we'll see. All right, guys. Uh... You're losing ever since you started trading a year ago. Well, I lost money the first two years of trading. And also, you know, if you have lost 100K and you have 100K left and you're still losing, you know what you should do? Take 70K, put it in the bank, okay? And keep trading with 30K. And once you double that 30K, Take another 30k from the bank. Once you double that, then you can take the rest. Okay? Build on strength. Don't build on weakness. Build on strength. Because if you if you if you can't, you know, if you don't learn the trading, you, you're just gonna blow your last hundred K. All right, guys. Uh, have a great weekend. See you to uh, see you tomorrow. See you on Monday. All right. Take care, guys.